Hello again, friends. Thanks for checking out this preview of some of the music for worship this coming Sunday, October 24th. This is a long-anticipated Sunday as we'll meet and hear from the Pastor Nominating Committee's candidate to serve as the next Pastor Head of Staff at Third Church. We're all eagerly anticipating this Sunday. The Chancel Choir will sing, the Choral Scholars will sing, the Celebration Ringers will ring, and we'll be welcoming several new members to the congregation, in addition to greeting the candidate. The sermon and service will focus on a couple of thought-provoking scripture readings, including one from Jeremiah and one from Mark, the gospel reading in particular, dealing with healing and faith, even in difficult circumstances. The chancel choir will offer a wonderfully sublime piece on a text found on a concentration camp wall following World War II. I believe in the sun even when it is not shining. I believe in God even when he is silent. Young Norwegian composer Kim Andre Arneson wrote a sublime setting of these words, which has become a favorite anthem of many in the choir. Here's a preview with a recording of the chancel choir from 2018.
The psalm for the day, providing material for the call to worship, is Psalm 34, one which offers both words of comfort and of challenge. The prelude I've chosen for the day is one of six psalm preludes written by Herbert Howells in the early 20th century. Howells was an incredibly gifted composer, remembered mostly for his church music written for the Anglican Church, organ works, and some of the most heavenly choral works imaginable. The first of his psalm preludes for organ, composed in 1915, sets verse 6 of Psalm 34. This poor soul cried and was heard by the Lord and was saved from every trouble. We can hear the pleas of the poor soul, building from a quiet intensity at the outset to full-voiced cries for help, eventually being resolved by God's grace as the piece winds down to a quiet and reassuring close. Here it is from a practice session just the other day.
In addition to these wonderful pieces, James Keeley will offer a postlude by French composer Jean Langlais. The Celebration Ringers, led by Jean Conover, will play a piece titled Calming Peace, something we all need these days. And the choral scholars will sing a lovely setting of the hymn, There's a Wideness in God's Mercy. I hope you'll join us, either in person or online, on our YouTube channel for worship this Sunday, October 24th. Until next time.